I am Satosh Gayankar. Today I am solving the problem of torsion. Subject is mechanics of material. It is the problem number 5. A mild steel shaft 50 mm diameter. Shaft is given 50 mm diameter. D is equal to 50 mm. And length is 10 times the diameter. Length is 10 times the diameter. That means 10 into diameter 50 10 into 50 it will be 500 mm 500 mm it tested in a, a torsion testing machine until one end rotated through an angle of angle is given theta is equal to 0 0.6 degree it has to be converted into radian therefore multiply by pi by 180 it will get converted into radians with respect to other end, okay, the torque measured was T is given 1135 Newton meter. We have to express in terms of mm multiply by 10 to 3. 1135 into 10 to 3 Newton mm. Find the value of shear modulus and shear stress. Shear modulus, we have to find out shear modulus G and shear stress how we have to find out. This is the formula. I am going to use it. T divided by JP is equal to tau divided by R is equal to G theta by L. We can't use these two combinations because tau is unknown, G is unknown. But T is given. First I will go for these two combinations. You know how to find out. So, this is a solid shaft. Therefore, R will be D by T d by f. If the two diameters are given, then it ends up hollow. There is a single diameter indicator is a solid shaft. T divided by Jp is equal to tau divided by R, where T is nothing but 1135 into 10 raised to 3. Polar moment of inertia for solid P is Jp is equal to pi by 32 into d raised to 4. This is the formula. Pi by 32 into diameter is 50 raised to 4 is equal to tau divided by 50 divided by 2 cross multiply the tau value will be 46.24 newton per mm square now we have to find out the shear modulus either you can go for the combination of these two or these two because we obtained the shear value we will get the same answer I will go for if I prefer the shear tau divided by r is equal to g theta by l because we have to find out the shear modulus 46 into 46.24 divided by r is r is is equal to g is plus theta pi d 0 0.6 into pi divided by 180 divided by length 500 cross multiply cross multiply you will get the g value is equal to 88311.89 newton per mm square newton per mm square In this way, you have to solve the problem. Thank you very much.